long time. Amazingly, uh, he actually befriended me versus me befriending him. And uh, we become really good friends. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy, what do you smell? Oh, he'll go give me a lick. Good boy. Gabriel's an uh, African, African male cheetah. Uh, he's part of a breeding project here. Uh, he's one of, the, um, one of the breeding males, although he hasn't bred yet. He has called to some females, but hasn't actually bred yet, huh, buddy? He had to find that right, uh, right female. <laughs> actually, it's the females that, that uh, pick the, uh, the male. He'll be five, five years old, August uh, 18, 2018, this year. In Gabriel's case here, I know that he loved he loves interaction, uh, and he's very friendly when he does it because he wants to interact. He wants to groom you. He wants to share time, uh, have you scratch him and pet him, uh, and it's just a nice break in a day of boredom for him. You know, so I have no fear of, of Gabriel when I first met when I first reacquaint with him and re, uh, reunite with him uh, when I return. Now I get to hold you. Now I get to hold you. Oh, that's good. That's a cost. Groom me. I get to. Feel and touch on you and make sure there's no problems, look for any kind of ticks or any issues. Uh, what I don't do is go up to him when he's uh, laying down or something and just say, hey, Gabriel, and I start petting him. I won't do that. Um, he, he's not a personality that I can do that with. There's some that are. Uh, some cheetahs are just like that. They just love it. And they always love interaction and company with you. You, you. you were like their mother to them. But Gabriel demands more respect, and that's, that's to me, is just more challenge for me. I, Makes you love Gabriel even more. He's got a nice, a nice temperament and a, a very, very adorable. But he also has this wild side to him that I love to, to, you know, to gain trust in, to breach. And I need to, I need to, when, to give him the uh, kind of life I want to give him. That's even better than this. This is a nice place for Gabriel, but there's there's something better for him, and it's called freedom. And I want to I want to give him a piece of that. And that's that game range that I I, I plan on uh, establishing in a breeding project for cheetahs, and teach Gabriel to follow commands, follow me, uh, jump in a jeep, wear a GPS collar, learn to hunt, um, learn to rewild, hunt for himself, and have some freedom on a, a closed game range. Uh, that's my ultimate goal for Gabriel. My ultimate reward for him is to do that.